The Concorde, the iconic supersonic jet, flying speed at over 1,350 miles per hour, could fly from New York to London in just three hours, but its high operating costs and one-way $12,000 ticket price made it unsustainable. The 2000 crash and the decline in business travel after September 11 hurt its reputation and demand. After 27 years, it was retired in 2003, marking the end of an era in aviation. The Concorde faced backlash over loud sonic booms, leading to bans on supersonic travel over land. Supersonic flight is making a comeback in 2025, and it's about to change the way we travel forever. NASA's X-59 aircraft, part of the quiet supersonic technology project, aims to minimize this issue with a softer sonic thump. Test flights in 2025 will help shape future legislation, with commercial supersonic flights, like Boone's Overture, expected by 2029. These new planes promise to hit speeds of over Mach 2.2, that's more than 1,500 miles per hour. Imagine slashing your flight time by half, getting to your destination in record time. But here's the kicker, these planes will use cutting-edge technology to reduce noise pollution and lower carbon emissions, something the Concorde couldn't quite pull off. Get ready to experience the future of air travel. Supersonic flight is coming back in a big way in 2025.